Okay, here are some of my snapdragons. And what I'm doing is I'm going to try to harvest the seeds. I've never done this for snapdragons. I've done it for um, uh, zinnias, that, and it worked very well. But So I already took some off of these. That's what this pile is. And so what I'm doing is I'm taking these big ones, and I'm just going in and snipping off the long st stems. That's all I'm doing right now. And then I'm going to, um, in a minute, try to um, get seeds out of those um, seed pods. So stay tuned. Okay, so I, just, I decided to come out to the backyard and um, film this because I started doing it inside the house and noticed there were little bugs in here. So I think that I try to look up like what it looks like and everything but i think these I'm trying to get the camera to focus bunch of like once i put them all on this platter i brought it outside all these black things are in there and i think those are the seeds so i tried a couple inside i should watch another youtuber and they had like a glass jar a big glass jar but i just went and got one of these um and then they just pulled off one of these dried snapdragon heads see they look like a little skull or something and then you're just supposed to crush them and the black seeds will come out but yeah I keep getting all the other stuff in there too so I'm not sure but there are I don't see those little black little black seeds in there so those are the um, snapdragon seeds so I have a whole bunch to do I'll probably just paste it out and do a few every day until I'm all done. Oh, what's that? Little ladybug got on there. I think I'll go transfer her to somewhere where she can eat her little heart out. And I'm gonna work on this and get some seeds. Those are my dogs who like to go crazy with the neighborhood dogs. Actually, it's the neighborhood dogs yelling, not my dogs. Okay, um, so you'll see if these will get planted next fall. <laughs> The husky next door is a little crazy. Um, next fall, I'll be trying to plant these um, and see how it turns out if they actually grow. I have planted snapdragons from seeds, just not seeds that I've harvested. So we will see that next spring. But if you have snapdragons right now, try this and we could be planting our seeds together. Bye. Okay, so after working a while on crushing these seeds, I tried something different because I was like, well, how did all these seeds get out here and they didn't get crushed? So instead, what I did was, this is probably a whole lot easier, especially if you have a whole bunch. I put it inside. Oh no, I don't know if I can do this with just one hand. Okay, well, maybe I can just shake it. So I kind of flicked it with my finger, you know, held the stem with one finger and then flicked it with the other. But look, this works just as well. Look, there were no seeds in there. And now look at how many I have in there. So I'm just going to do that with all these stems. It'll be a lot easier. And if I don't get all the seeds, that's okay. This looks like it's going to be tons of seeds and plenty for next year. So every time I think I'm done making the video, I decide to keep filming. So these are all the ones I've already shaken out the seeds of. This is what's left. Some of this is not seeds. And so far, that's how many seeds I have. Some of that's not seeds. but And look, as I was shaking, things are coming off on the table there's still tons of seeds inside of my tray. See all those little bitty ones? Um, so I want to show you a couple of things. Not all of these are seeds. Like this one is just some flowers that I just actually trimmed off. So it's um, got no seed pods on it. Um, maybe if I had let it go longer, it would have, but I think I have plenty um, to not worry about. This one has like, almost looks like white something nasty all over it so I'm not even gonna shake that one I doubt I think those are kind of soft so I doubt that they would work anyway so some of what I've put over here the greener ones I'll go through and like pick out these greener ones and just move them into my um, stash of what I'm gonna be throwing away and underneath this pack I picked it up a little while ago and there's seeds all underneath there too so I am going to get some envelopes to put these seeds in and um, when I do zinnia seeds, well, the first time I did zinnia seeds, I just saved them and used them the next year. 
Um, then the next time I save them by color um, because I don't like all the colors in, I love Dream Lanzania, but I, I'm not a fan of oranges and reds and some of them are just too orange and red. So I saved them by color that time. So um, since I'm in my new house, um, I did not save my zinnia seeds last year. So I'm having to, going to have to buy new ones and I will probably save the seeds from color so that I can go back and plant just the ones that I want it. Um, next year, but these um, snapdragons, I pretty much liked all the colors in them, so it didn't really matter. Okay, stay tuned for um, putting them into seed packets. Okay, once again, another um, snippet before I did seed packs, I finished all those. Um, I started throwing them in my little waste bag here, but I do have all these that I'm going to pick up and put into my trash that you can see how many seeds were left behind. So can you see the blue on the crown? See all of those, all these little bitty specks are seeds. Okay, so I've got to try to collect those and all of this. That's Some of that might be a little bit of dirt, but most of it is actual seeds. So I'm gonna go through and pick out all the big pieces of dead flowers and seed pods and then I'm gonna kind of sweep all those seeds into my pot. And there are tons of little crawly bugs, little spiders, all kinds of stuff in here. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with them. Okay, so for all the bugs that I told you I kept seeing in there, you can see them climbing up the glass. So I'm just waiting until they climb up the glass and then I'm grabbing them and throwing them out. And we'll see if I can get most of them out that way unless they try to get back into the glass. Okay, so we'll just, I'll just kind of wait. See, I just tapped it and here comes another one. And you kind of see the dirt almost moving in there or the extra stuff that's not seeds because there are bugs all in there. So I'm gonna try to get those to all crawl out before I package them up. So it might take a little while. Okay, here are my snapdragon seeds. See them all inside of here? Okay, so I sent away for some seed envelopes um, from Amazon. This is what the label says. I just looked for how many I wanted and um, the price that was okay and that they would be here in a couple of days. So this is what the envelope looks like, super simple. And so I'm just gonna put some seeds in here and seal them up to wait or maybe give out. So these are snapdragon seeds. I'll be writing that on the outside. I don't remember what kind of snapdragons because it's been a while I didn't realize I was going to seed them. This is my first time doing snapdragon seeds. So I think I'm just gonna take um, maybe a pinch, a pinch full of the seeds. Get them inside of here. Maybe two pinches. I don't really need a whole lot of you know, envelopes. I'm not trying to give away like 25 envelopes or anything. Um, so I'm just going to be putting a couple pinches in each seed. I'm sure that's a lot of seeds. You know, I'm not going to count them or anything, but um, it feels like a lot of seeds. These seeds are tiny. Snapdragon seeds are tiny. So I'm sure it's going to give whoever I give these to, or if I replant them, I won't re be replanting all of these. There's just way too many, um, but it will give whoever I give them to plenty. And there weren't just seeds in here. If you can see there, it's kind of hard to see inside of there, but there's some just pieces of, I guess, the seed pods in there. Uh, I hope that doesn't hurt it. I don't think it will, right? It should just degrade, um, but so that's it. I'm going to package these up and I am going to uh, put a label on them and I will be done and ready to um, give some of these away. Thanks for watching me um, get the snapdragon seeds for um, this spring.